Detroit, the near future. Officer Alex J. Murphy and his partner, Ann Lewis, fight to rid the decaying city of the criminal element which infests it. After being mortally wounded in the line of duty, Officer Murphy is outfitted by OCP with bulletproof titanium robotic parts and with computer-enhanced motor and sensory capabilities. He has become the ultimate super cop. Robocop. See? I told you, Samson. This place is a regular gold mine. Yeah. Pick a car. Any car. <laughs> I don't believe it. It's Robocop. Thank you, Murphy. You're welcome, Lewis. Call me Anne tonight, okay? Yes, Lewis. Anne. Boy, we're lucky that walking tin can didn't see us. Come on, Samson. We gotta work fast. Get back up! Sacre bleu! My word! Bon appétit, Monsieur Robocop. Thank you. I'm glad you accepted my invitation to dinner, Murphy. It's it's nice to hang loose once in a while. I I feel strange here. You might look different than anyone else, but underneath all that metal, you're still a human being. Am I? Help! Someone stole my car! Excuse me, I have to run. But Murphy! Hey, this car gets really bad gas. I like it. Too bad, because we're going to sell it as fast as we can. Huh? Pull over to the side of the road. Blast. Looks like Robocop didn't stay for dessert. Proceeding west on Lee Boulevard, heading toward Kirby Avenue. Step on it, Samson. We got to lose this joke. <laughs> This ought to slow down that overgrown trash compactor. Now that Bucket Brains is busy, let's get out of here. No problem. Great balls of fire, this cop's not giving up. to remain silent. But gee, officer, I didn't realize I was going that fast. Oh, shut up, Jake. But Lewis, he was just doing his job. Nobody walks out on Ann Lewis. Not even Robocop. Welcome. Good work, Robo. Thank you, Sergeant. <clears throat> Thanks for ruining our date, Murphy. You could have at least let me come along with you. Sorry, there was no time to waste. Waste? Excuse me, I must recharge my power supply. Oh, the nerve of that man! Looks like you need another date, Lewis. I'm available. You might be, but I'm not. And he said, that wasn't my wife, that was a hedgehog. <laughs> and now, a word from Omni Consumer Products. Food, shelter, transportation, and travel. These are just a few of the things that OCP has to offer the fine citizens of old Detroit. As the head of Omni Consumer Products, I've dedicated my life to serving the needs of the people. Remember, at OCP, you, the consumer, are number one. Liar! OCP is just a lousy scam. And the old man is the biggest crook of them all. Yeah! That's right. Hey, Scrambler, what's your beef? If it wasn't for the old man, I wouldn't be inside this rotten place. I wasn't the only OCP employee who skimmed a little profit off the top. Yeah, but you were the only one who got caught. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's not funny. 
The Scrambler's a genius. Someday I'll find a way to destroy OCP and the old man. Then I'll have the last laugh. Looks like old Robocop's catching 40 winks. I wonder what he's dreaming. His dreams are of no concern to me, Roosevelt. What matters is that Robocop's reflexes are operating smoothly and his circuitry is functioning to the max. In a word, he's perfect. Phew. That's one thing we don't want falling into the wrong hands. Gee, Scrambler, what book are you looking for? Quiet, you fool. I'm not looking for any book. I'm trying to break into OCP's main computer. I found it. <laughs> Now, what should I play with first? Uh, how about a game of video basketball? <laughs> That's it, Project Robocop. And this must be the password that'll get me into the file. Perfect. <sighs> well, it's time for me to call it a night, Roosevelt. Make sure that Robocop continues his recharging cycle. No sweat, Doc. I'll keep an eye on the old cybernetic snoozer. <gasps> oh, no. I accidentally left the password to Robocop's file on the screen. Well, I must be tired. Well, I'll see you in the morning. Good night, Dr. Tyler. <sighs> this is gonna be one of the easiest shifts I've ever had. Oh. What in blazes is going on? <laughs> Hey, Robo, what's wrong? You having a bad dream? Unbelievable. Robocop's walking in his sleep. I must destroy the power. Forgot to pay the electric bill, Scrambler? You insignificant insect. This is just part of my plan. Need I say more? Hey! Wait for me! Thanks, Robocop. This is just what the Scrambler ordered. Your plan worked like a charm, pal. We're gonna be free! What do you mean, we? <laughs> Gee, you must have gotten up on the wrong side of bed today. He's awake. It's about time. Where have you been all night? Here. Sorry, Robo, but you took a little walk in your sleep. You must have gone somewhere. I do not understand. Neither do I. Last night, there was a jailbreak at the Metro South Prison, and according to eyewitness reports, a seven-foot giant smashed through the prison walls. Just a minute, Sarge. There's only one seven-foot giant I know, and he would never do anything like that. Look, kid, we're not gonna score any touchdowns just jawboning about it. I want some answers, and I want them now! Look at this damage. Whoever did this must be incredibly strong. Like me. I hate to say this, Murphy, but I wonder if there is a connection between your disappearing act and the jailbreak last night. But, Lewis, I... Oh! Oh! Murphy, what's wrong? I... I do not... No! Thanks, Robocop. This is just what the Scrambler ordered. Ah! 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 Perfect. Perfect. My plan is working perfectly. I've waited a long time for this moment. Ooh, the Scrambler. Is this some kind of joke? Oh, this is no laughing matter, old man. Your time has come. As usual, your threats are meaningless. I'll have you back in jail as soon as the police can find you. You'd better hurry, then. 
by the end of the day, Omni Consumer Products will be out of business for good, and you all may reduce to a distant memory. <laughs> The reprogramming of RoboCop's system is finally complete. OCP's SuperCop is now under my control, and no one can stop me. Hey, Murphy, what's going on? Where do you think you're going? Huh. This is the second time that man's run off without me. Put a lid on it! I don't want to hear one more word from you creeps. It makes Frederick nervous. Yeah! <laughs> huh? Robocop! What's he doing? What's oh, going on? No. Robocop isn't a super cop anymore. He's a super crop. He did what? Where's Tyler? What seems to be the problem, Sergeant? The problem is your cybernetic pal just robbed a bank. Say what? That's impossible. Tell that to the witnesses who saw him haul off 20 grand in broad daylight. I... I don't understand. Robbing a bank would violate his prime directive. Well, you geniuses had better figure out what's wrong with that walk-in can opener before he really hurts someone. You've served me well, my friend. And this is only the beginning. Together, we'll crush OCP. <laughs> What's going on? It's Robocop! He's trapped in the research lab! Stop him! Not me. I'm getting out of here before this whole place blows up. Attention all units. Be on the lookout for Robocop. He is armed and dangerous. That metallic maniac is destroying OCP facilities all over town. He's got to be stopped. I'm trying, Lieutenant, but he's not responding to my commands. If I could just talk with Murphy, I know I could reason with him. You keep out of this, officer. But I was only trying to... You've been trying to undermine my authority with Robocop from day one. By constantly interfering with his program behavior, you've confused his basic operating commands. That's a load of red cabbage, and you know it. Listen. That crazed cyborg is too dangerous to roam the streets. If you ladies can't get it together to stop him, I will. Do not hesitate, my robotic friend. Destroy. Destroy. Destroy! you'd cross the line someday, you rustling bucket of bolts. Make one more move and you'll wind up in the junkyard. Don't let them take you, you fool. Escape! Hey, what's he doing? Dark! He's getting away! Stop him! He's firing men! It's no use, sir. Laugh! I'll get that renegade robot if it's the last thing I do. By now, you've heard what I did to your precious facilities. As you see, Robocop is under my complete control. And now he's coming after you. I hope your affairs are in order. <laughs> Goodbye. You warned me that Robocop might turn against OCP someday, Dr. McNamara. I'm afraid there's only one thing left to do. Dr. Tyler, pull the plug on Robocop. What? But, but, sir, I was just about to... Yes, sir. I understand. What's wrong, Doc? That was the old man. He ordered me to pull the plug. 
Oh, man. But that would destroy Murphy. You can't do it, Doctor. It it'd be like murder. Do you think I want to? Hey, nobody wants to do this, but we've got to. Robocop's out of control and dangerous. <sighs> I've put the last three years of my life into this project, Sergeant. But I suppose you're right. We have no choice. No! <sighs> there. It's done. What in the... Those fools thought they get out with the scrambler. What's going on? I, I, I can't shut down the system. Someone's overridden my commands. Look! It's Robo One, and he's heading towards OCP headquarters. Oh no! Somebody's gotta stop him! Let nothing stop you! Vengeance must be mine! <laughs> He's headed your way, Hitchcock. Don't worry, we're ready for him. There he is, sir. Fire! We need aerial support. Fast! Lieutenant, where's Robocop? Your bucket headed boyfriend's playing King Kong! Oh no! I just hope I'm not too late! Stop! Lewis! That's in order! What in heaven's name is going on out there? Keep away from the window, sir. It might be dangerous. But we're 80 stories high. No one could possibly... Robocop! Hold it right there, Tin Man! I have come for you, old man. No, stay back. Murphy, wait! You don't know what you're doing. This isn't right. You know it isn't. Don't stop, you metallic moron! Execute your command! You're a good cop, Murphy. Think of your prime directives. Serve the public trust, uphold the law, protect the innocent! Don't listen to her! Shoot! Murphy, please! <laughs> Are you all right? Yes. Thanks to you. Hey, what are partners for? Please excuse me. Wait! Where are you going? To take care of unfinished business. Murphy, wait! Grant, I lost control of Robocop. Better get out of here before he comes looking for me. You are too late. Robocop! You are under arrest. That's what you think. <laughs> halt, or there will be trouble. Ha! You'll never catch me, you computerized cretin. Guess again, creep. You have the right to remain silent. If you cannot afford an attorney, the court will appoint one. Oh. 
Yes, that's right, sir. The scrambler's behind bars, and I've changed Robocop's password so this can never happen again. I trust you'll see that it doesn't, Dr. Tyler. Yes, sir. How are you feeling, Murphy? Now I realize that Dr. Tyler was right. I am nothing but a machine. It's about time you figured that out. Are you crazy? Sure, the scrambler messed with your brain, but you proved that your humanity is still stronger than any computer program. I... I had not thought of it that way. Hey, sounds like this calls for a celebration. Right. I'll take you to dinner again. Uh, no thank you. What? This time, let's get takeout.